A National Security Bureau report is pointed to Donald Trump's comments during his campaign, in which he pledged to make allies pay a greater proportion of their defense costs as one reason why a Trump administration might create more room for Taiwan U.S. arms sales. During legislative questioning today, Deputy Defense Minister Paul Hong Hui agreed that Taiwan in the past has typically enjoyed more military arms sales under Republican administrations. But Bo dismissed out of hand the possibility of the country being offered to buy the vertical takeoff and landing capable F-35 joint strike fighter, saying such an arrangement was fanciful at best.